Paid to play players. What a pleasant surprise. This morning's full surprise is Star Shigong. Tricked for people than a few hundred. This is a surprise. Silence. This isn't an army. We heard free to play players were on the warpath. We were eager to join forces. If it is blood you seek, you're welcome to join us. But you only bring this handful of players against top alliances? See, I was wrong to expect free to play commitment to match our own. Doesn't it? You, there. What is your profession? I'm a potter. So. And you, Arcadian, what is your profession? Sculptor, sir. You? Blacksmith. Grinders! What is your profession? You see, pay to play player, I brought more players than you did. That's right! Anyways, guys, Dar Shigong here, Gaming on the Dark Side. Welcome to another video. Just want to say something really quick before we get started. Hey guys, be sure to like, comment, and if I've earned it, please hit subscribe. Alright, here we go. Episode number 9. This is our Dawn of Titans Can I Do This event for free. This week, we're going to be talking about... Ares. That's right, Ares is back and he's bringing his Spartans with him. This event is going to be a 21,000 soul event. Like I said, it's bringing back Ares and his Spartans and a brand new synergy relic for him, which is going to really buff those Spartans. So if you like Ares and you like playing with his Spartans, well, hey, this is the event for you. So let's go ahead and check out the numbers and see can we do this event for free? Now, don't forget, before we get started, I always do this. Make sure you realize I do not factor in the Portal Stone refresh rate or Portal Stone reward drops. I have no idea what that's going to be for you. It's, everyone's different. Um, and like I said, I base the time frame off a of 30 second PP attack turnaround time. So if it takes you longer to do the attacks, then hey, factor that in. So think of these as guesstimations. Let's start off with a pure grind, no relics at all look. All right, if you're not using any relics, but you are using a top boost Titan, that 1.4 boost Titan, it's gonna take you 1,500 battles to get this thing done. That's gonna take, using the Portal Stone awards that are in the event, about 3,650 Portal Stones to get all those battles done. Um, if you don't have those saved up, then you're gonna have to buy them with some gems. That's gonna take about 17,200 gems, which also includes, of course, the rewards that are in there. It's gonna take about 12 and a half hours to grind it out, which is plenty of time since we have 90 hours in the event. So you guys can, even if you took a minute per battle, you can get this thing done in about a day, which is great. Now, there is a 2,500 soul minimum. This is for any player that's, you know, doesn't want to necessarily finish the event and wants to be saving up their tokens and gems and all that stuff for the next event, which I want to say is Valkyrie Reborn. And also, um, uh, when that one comes out, we're going to want to have, have plenty of relics. That's going to be a finished plus event. So, you know, it's going to be like, what, 30,000 some odd souls or something. So anyways, for a 2,500 soul minimum, it's going to take you 179 battles. Using the rewards, we're looking at 187 portal stones which would be pretty easy to just get done through refresh rates over the course of the whole weekend. And about 722 gems if you just want to get those portal stones and be done. It'll take you about an hour and a half of grinding to get it finished. And let's move out. Now, if you're going to use the included boost relics that are in the event rewards, there's six of them. Using a worst case scenario and saying we're only getting one star rolls on those things, it's going to help out, but not by much. It's going to reduce your battles down to only 1,356 battles to grind out the event. It's going to take about a total of 3,218 portal stones. If you need to get those stones, you're looking at an investment of 14,608 gems and a little over 11 hours to grind it out. So just keep that in mind, guys. If you're going to use the relics and nothing else, that's what you're kind of looking at as a base. Um, hopefully your rolls will be better and it won't take that long. If you're curious what we can shave off with a two-star, three-star, or four-star rolls, let's go ahead and switch over to my handy little chart. All right, so this little chart here is gonna show you what you can expect to 
I'm gonna bring down cost wise with better rolls. I got the one star, two star, three star, and four stars broken down. Um, the battles of finish, just take those and subtract that from the total amount of battles you gotta get done based on each one of these relics. How many portal stones, that's the reduction there. How many gems, you have know, less to worry about. And how much time you can shave off. I also wrote down the total souls you can get from all eight battles. Now remember, those souls are based off an unstacked amount, you know, not using stacked um, uh, relics. So not putting a two and a three star together, but using them separately, finishing all the battles and moving on from there. If you stack them, the soul counts will be a little bit different, but hey, that's totally up to you guys if that's something you wanna do. Um, myself, personally, I don't stack because I like getting all the extra XP, forging and food, fusion food and all that stuff. But to each their own, do what you gotta do. Hopefully this little table helps you guys out. And of course, lastly, I always like to cover the all relic. This is like, you know, bad, bad luck. You roll nothing but one stars the entire time and that's all you get. Well, if that's the case, it's gonna take you 41 saved relics to get this thing done. That's insane, right? Well, that's a total of 47 relics to finish this entire event. That's about 370 battles, 260 portal stones. The only benefit I can say is that you will leave with a positive gain of 3,000 gems. And it takes about an hour and a half to get done. But that's it, man. That 3,000 gems is not worth spending that many relics. Just my input, guys. And that's the video, guys. Can we grind this event for free? It's all going to depend on what you've saved up over time and if you feel that it's worth it. Now, if you want a full event overview, I'll be working on that today, and I'll do my best to try and drop that tonight or tomorrow. Um, be sure to be liked and subscribed if you want to see that video pop up on your feed. Otherwise, you guys might miss it. Um, all right. Hey, this is Dar Shigong, and I hope to catch all of you guys gaming on the dark side.